Well, I'm feeling a bit parched from making that teaching, so I'm gonna make my first smoothie here. And uh, I, uh, I got this blender as a gift, and so I was gonna make this video my first time using it. I don't know if you know, but at Walmart and probably lots of other places, you can buy these in the freezer section where they got like pre-made smoothie mixes with frozen vegetables that are already sliced and ready. Let's see. I got a couple different ones. This one has peanut butter and bananas. I think so. I'm gonna try to quit drinking pop and uh, for the most part or slow down majorly anyways and I need to start taking more fruits and vegetables so I thought maybe this would kind of help. But uh, it's a good thing to do. So that's kind of why I'm making this video too. Um, just maybe to encourage other people if you think about it, I'm going to try to set this up here. don't know how well this will record. This. Well, I think it's a good thing to eat healthy and stuff. I don't think it's wrong with drinking pop and stuff. I made that video, you know, before where I drank Monster and stuff. And uh, I definitely need to slow down on that. This stuff's been giving me heartburn and like acid reflux so <laughs> I mean you know you'll pay your own price for drinking that stuff if you do it a lot but you want to do things in moderation or not very much but this is kind of a good alternative it's probably it's a little more expensive but here's the, here's the fruit. this has pineapple banana cranberry kale and lemon it says it's high in vitamin C and dietary fiber all you have to do is add water and blend. Okay, just a cup of water. So, put this away. And so I got, uh, my mom got a blender from Walmart for like 10 bucks. It was this little one and like it immediately burnt out when we tried to use it. So I think a blender is kind of something you might want to put a little bit of money down on. I think this one was like 50 or 60 bucks. But like I said, it was a gift, and I'm really grateful for it. But um, probably want to spend a little bit of money on a blender that has, you know, make sure it has a little bit of power. Uh, so hopefully this one will do fine. This is my first time using it, so... Like I said, buying these, you know, I don't know if it's cheaper to make them yourself or buy them in the packages, but it's probably a little more expensive than drinking pop and things, but I'm not going to do it all the time, you know. I'm going to, I drink a lot of water, and so this is, for one, just to break up the, you know, boredom of drinking water all the time, and plus it's to get more fruits and vegetables in my system, which I'm not very good at, so... Um, so I got that in there. Get a cup of water. This blender's gonna be really loud, I think, but it doesn't take very long. So screw that cap on. Now, it's down in here. Plug it in.
So I just made this video just to show how dumb I am doing this. Yeah. It could have been my fault that mom's blender burn out because I don't know what I'm doing here, I guess. It's got instructions. Let's see. more water. Where's the max line on this thing? I'm not supposed to go past that. I think we're still good there. Now maybe it was my fault that mom's blender <laughs> didn't work right. Maybe you need to make sure that there's more water in these things. I guess you just can't put it in there like that. But I think it only says like a cup of water on the package, so that's why. I think this is good enough though. So it's like a learning experience for me, right? Man, I feel bad about Home Splendor now. I just don't know what I'm doing. I've never really used one like this. Well, it was pretty good, so <laughs> that's awesome. I'm glad. Hmm. Yeah, I just need to learn how to use a blender. So, well, that's that. Uh, thank you for the guy who got this and. I'll be putting it to use. Thanks for watching, guys. God bless. <laughs>